Hi guys, welcome back to Teen Dex. In today's video, I have brought you some cool tips to increase your performance of your Samsung Galaxy mid-range smartphones. Guys, you already know that the Samsung Galaxy flagship like Note series or the S series have their inbuilt high performance mode. For the mid-range smartphones, you do not have the high performance mode. Guys, in this video, I will be showing you how to enhance and how to have the high performance mode on or the beast mode for your Samsung Galaxy mid-range smartphones whether it's running on One UI 1.0 or 2.0 and it, it just works on the models like A50, A70, A30 and much more so guys before starting our video if you are new to our channel please subscribe to our channel for great and amazing tech videos well let's get started first thing is just go to your settings and just click on about phone after going to about phone, tap on software information and just tap on build number for 7 times. After that, developer mode will be enabled. Just go back and click on the developer options and enable it. Guys, just don't do any other settings. Just do the settings which I'm just showing in my smartphone. Just scroll down to very end and you will find these three options. Window animation scale, transition animation scale, and animated duration scale. Just tap on the window animation scale and, and turn off the animations. Alright, guys, just do this to all the three options. Now, with these options, your smartphone will not have any animations like app opening or app closing or switching to other app animation, and animations will be off. So, with this, it improves your smartphone performance. Alright, guys. The next changes you have to do is just scroll down, click on the background process limit. It will be present default in standard limit. Just off it and just turn on the utmost 4 processes. By keeping utmost 4 processes, in the background only 4 processes will be running, other processes will be terminated. By this, the load for the RAM reduces and it increases the performance of a smartphone. The next trick is related to the fingerprint scanner just head on to your biometrics and security just go to fingerprints and just register your fingerprint for at least two times or three times guys by doing this it improves the speed of your fingerprint scanner and improves the accuracy alright guys the next feature you have to use it device care just head on to your device care and optimize your device at least twice a day. By optimizing, it increases the battery life and reduces the structs and lags in your smartphone and improves performance. Next thing you have to just change is head on to your search bar and just tap on auto restart. By searching on this, you will get this option. And just enable it and use it by doing this it just automatically restarts and your phone will just completely get refreshed and the performance increases and your phone will only restart when the screen is off phone isn't being used the battery is about 30 percent and sim card lock is off all right guys the next thing is dark mode just head on to your settings panel just tap on hold it you will get to this dark mode settings and use this turn, turn on as schedule by using this you can just keep a time limit to start time and end time by using this the battery performance increases while you are not using your smartphone and it just goes to dark mode and it just resembles to the wind down option which is present already but this option works very good guys you should definitely check it out the next thing is as I told is wind down. Wind down it just completely turns your smartphone into a black and white texture. Just head on to your settings, tap on the search bar, click on wind down. Alright guys, just click on wind down and you can find this option. I have already enabled it. After clicking on wind down, it changes the screen into grayscale and it turns do not disturb. With this, you will not get any notifications and your 
battery lasts longer. Okay guys, the next trick is related for the gamers. Many people are just playing PUBG, Call of Duty and much more. Alright guys, with this plugin, you can just enhance your gaming experience in Samsung Galaxy mid range smartphones. Just head on to your Samsung Galaxy store and just download this module. Game plugin. Then search it. You will be finding this option. In other similar apps, you will find this game plugin here. Tap on it and just install it. After installing it, it just automatically adds the games which are present. Tap on it and just open it. After opening, you can find other three modules like Game Booster Plus, Perf, Daily Limits. I'll explain you the first module. You click on the Game Booster Plus. You can fully customize it like I have some few games. If you take a Real Racing 3, you can just have some few settings like you can just increase the performance options like focus on power saving, balance, focus on performance and you can increase the graphics quality to just to 100% or you can reduce. You can increase the FPS running on your smartphone and you can increase the brightness. Okay guys, you can apply this option to all the games so you just don't need to change it always. Down you can find other 5 options like battery saving, balance, max FPS, high quality. Guys, if you want to have an immersive and a high performance gaming experience, I suggest you to just click on high quality. It just automatically uh, customize according to the game. Just tap on the auto mode. Apply the best mode automatically based on the analysis of your gameplay data. If you tap on this, it just automatically analyzes and you can see max FPS, temperature, graphics quality. The graphics quality is medium. FPS stability is also medium. FPS is more. Battery is medium and it shows you temperature. Alright guys, if you click on apply, it just applies on it. And while you're playing, at down you can just see the gaming settings. If you click on it, you can see the temperature of a smartphone and maximum FPS running on your smartphone while you're playing. Alright guys, the next module is Perf X. Tap on it, you have to just download separate modules to enable or use it. Just tap on the Perf Z. It just asks you the permissions. That is just all of the permissions and it shows you the FPS, CPU, GPU and temperature of your smartphone. Guys, if you want to really analyze how your smartphone just works while gaming, so definitely check it out. It's a very good feature. Alright guys, the last module is the daily limits and I have not just downloaded it. Just tap on it, it just directly redirects to the Samsung Galaxy store and you have to download this module. After downloading, you can see this module says that it is daily limits, improve your time management, set your time to play, be informed when time is up. Alright, with this name, you can see that you can just limit the playing of games and increase the productivity. You can just limit a particular game for this time, after that time the, the game just offs automatically. Alright guys, I have just already installed it. Just tap on the daily limits and enable it. After clicking on daily limits, just click on start. It just asks you some permissions. Allow usage tracking. And there you go. It's asks you to appear on top. Okay. There you go. You can see you can just set the limits like total daily limit and if you click on the settings you can find time limit pop-ups show pop-ups that show your daily time limits during gameplay 
and time limit notifications receive notifications when you are about to reach the gameplay time limits use this feature to increase the productivity and just reduce the limit for your gaming all right guys hope you guys enjoyed my video if you like my video please hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for great and amazing tech videos and just comment down below which of the trick you like the most and thanks for your support i'll see you in the next one